Welcome to the 30 day Make Your Switch Fitness Challenge. Welcome to another absolutely super fast fitness video with me, James. Today we're going to be hitting those abs again. Uh, we're going to be supersetting this to try and create a real good metabolic effect and also to really overload that area in as short a time as possible. This video is only three, maybe to five minutes long maximum. Okay, guys, so absolutely no reason why you can't get this in at any point during your day and during your week. Okay, I want you to get a good sweat on during this. I want you to give it your very, very, very best. We're going to start things off with one of my favorite ab exercises is really good for the obliques we're going to start off with a Russian twist so good Russian twist starts in this position and you lower down to that halfway position like so stick your arms out to the front and make sure you can feel it in the abs when I shout go go we're going to start twisting side to side now what I don't want you to do is imagine that you're placing something down on the floor I want you to keep your elbows tight in and twist left and right like so I don't want this kind of movement like that okay I want you to keep it real tight like so, and you're just gonna try and do as many as you can in this time. Now, if you're particularly strong at doing Russian twists, do try and progress it. Maybe hold on to a medicine ball in your hand, or it could even be a tin of beans if you're at home, that's not a problem. Or even try and lift, or start lifting your feet off of the floor. It's always important that you try and progress these things. Now, as soon as you've done that, we're gonna stop after about 30 seconds, and we're just gonna hold this halfway position. Now, this is gonna be a little bit of a different kind of exercise. When you're holding that position, just like so at halfway, it's a real good isometric contraction. The muscles have it to really hold. And this is a great way of building core strength and building the strength around that ab area. And because we're working the two exercises together and working that same area, we're gonna get that overload effect. That's what we're going for. And as soon as we've done that, 30 seconds have gone, we're gonna start twisting left and right again. Now, we're just going for three sets of 30 seconds. That's all we're going for. There's absolutely no reason why you guys back there, back behind the screens, can't give this your absolute very, very, very best. Okay, so let's really go for this, guys. Let's try and get as much from this as we possibly can. I want you to imagine that you've got a sore and you're soaring yourself some abs. Really get across like that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's what we want. Okay, get mega serious with what you're doing and also enjoy what you're doing. Five minutes, that's all it is. Even a great little exercise set of exercises to do at the end of another workout perhaps. And as soon as we've done our 30 seconds, hold that halfway position again, like so. And you just wanna hold that. Now if you really wanna progress that and make that harder again, you can make this a little bit tougher by holding onto a weight. Maybe if you're lucky enough to own something like a weighted vest or like you could use that. Or even just slowly start lowering yourself down to an even more advanced position. Usually the lower you get towards the floor, the more advanced the position. Okay, once we're there, we're gonna come up and we're gonna go into what is the final set. So knowing it's your final set, the finish line is there ahead of you and you're gonna to sprint towards it. The crowds are cheering and going wild either side. They're waving banners with your name on and I want you to really start going for it, soaring yourself those abs. You don't wanna come away from this little mini workout and think, oh, do you know what, I could have done a little bit more than that. Even though it's only less than five minutes of your time, I want you to come away from this and think, do you know what? I put it all on the line in that small little window that I was asked to do today, and I got absolutely everything from it, and now I feel amazing. And as soon as you're done, hold that position there. So we've got 30 more seconds holding that position, and again, knowing this is the last time in that isometric sit-up hold, try and advance the movement, make it tougher. Maybe lift the foot off the floor, maybe lift two off the floor. Just try and progress it. Other ways of making it even tougher. You might put your arms out to the side. You might put your arms above your head. Really, really important that as you go forward and maybe repeat these little mini workouts, chucking them on the end of your other workouts or just doing them before you have your breakfast, it's important that you're constantly trying to find ways to make that body say, who is this crazy person? What are they doing to me? because that's gonna make you make a change. And time. There you go. That's all it was. Three supersetted exercises, just 30 seconds per exercise, three minutes in total. It's done. Now you can go away, walk tall for the rest of the day, big smile on your face. I know that you've done something. So I'm looking forward to seeing you in my next quick, super fast fitness video.